What's up everybody, this is Mouse Callahan and this is Salt in the Sanctuary. Before we get started, like, subscribe, and share this video, help the channel grow, and help this community grow too. Alrighty then now, let's get back to the video. So we are picking up roughly the same place where we left off before. <clears throat> I went back here to the sunken keep so I could level up and uh get some equipment and then now my character is strong enough that where I can carry the full set of steel armor now talk with the guy so I can head over so since we already finished the whole dome of the forgotten the next place is a hacker cave caverns <clears throat> got one blacksmith here and I think I'm out of guides this reason why I didn't put one here, I believe. Nope, I got two guides in the dome. And I really don't need one here now. I would like a leader just so I can get more experience. Oh yeah, 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 I can really make some up. I got that. I already talked to this homie. Yep. Now. Oh yeah, yeah. I changed the controls around so it'd be more like how playing Dark Souls is. <laughs> Just because every time I play, I'm like, I go to press the right at the same moment. But I don't need to be up here. I was already up here earlier. A few videos ago, I don't need to go down. damage or not, but those guys are, they are not friendly, alright, yeah those guys, they are easy to take, but if you let them do their call, if you let them do that scream attack, they will jack you up, they do such high damage, those people, yeah, it, it ain't even Alright now, switch over to my pistol. Yeah, I got a pistol weapon. And let's go to lightning rounds. Okay, that was... that took longer than I wanted it to take. <clears throat> and these skeletons... these skeletons aren't that bad just because they have a shield. And... Yeah, so they're stone locked. Like the second you hit them, they are stone locked. So you can take out a whole group of them really easily. That whole little group there, if you have melee or like a sword of some sort, just go over there and start swinging it. Just keep swinging as you walk through. You'll be able to take them all out. You'll take out all three skeletons, all the bandits. That's a stone mage and two pale witch ears. Okay, I see that. <laughs> oh, I don't know what's up with this woman, dude, but I'm all stuffed up. Nose is all stuffy. Oh, 
always sounds a little weird, a little shot. Oh, I don't know if I'm getting sick or whatnot. <coughs> Just so I can see a little bit. This is a very dark game. Just literally, it is literally dark. What is over here? I'm gonna try it. And you are. Oh! setting so this is another area I found I was just trying to farm these guys for their stuff yeah the I keep pressing the wrong button just because I'm so set for how the controllers work Wait, which is kind of annoying is that I'm guessing I just played this game too long where it's like hey Yep, they killed me. Dang it. Okay, the armor might, so I'm just gonna have to shoot them from a range again. Because apparently I can't do enough damage with my physical... With my... Axe. My axe, because they keep tearing me up. Another area that just opens you up to another pathway that can really be opened up by a another That's one of the shortcuts from another path. Come on, dude. There. Yeah, I'm running low on those. I can buy some. Yep! <laughs> oh, that is so annoying. I just tried to jump over and I just couldn't. follow me for a little bit but after uh after this you won't be able to follow me at all yeah that's the last area you see how large that screw zone is and i don't think it's following me now There. 
Nine shots and it's dead. There. Come on. Come on, you fool. Oh, my attacks are so little damage. It's annoying. And I even have the fire charm on. That should be the only damage. Wrong loadout. <laughs> I had the gun loadout instead of the instead of my correct fighting loadout. least a hundred and something life. Two and three. They're dead. Okay, jump. <clears throat> I'm fine with falling all the way down again. Because now that area is completely opened up. So I can grab it. Ring of Brilliance! This gives me... A aura. Another infantry poleaxe? Yes, I did. All right. Okay. took them out easily. Okay. Now let's fight the boss. A full stack of bread. I got this light on me. That is, it's not as good as a torch, but it's a free light and it's not the little lantern that takes up your little uh, weapon slot. Up and down here. So yeah, we'll check this area out. This, yeah, you can see one of the swordsmen there. I'm gonna take my time on this one. Yep, you see these guys. Not that difficult to kill, but they are, they're jerks, regardless of, of the way that you put it, these guys are not friendly, they're all jerks. I got the Ring of Mending, I don't think I need that, uh, I'll just freeze my strength just so I can have a stronger weapon. Actually, Dex might do the same, because it'll increase the damage of my shot, or my flintlock pistol, whatever it's called, my gun. It'll increase the damage of the gun. Okay, I don't need to do that. I need to get up there. Turn on the torch. Going down. Hitting the obelisk of... Oh! I keep thinking it's my robot. I don't know why I keep doing that. I think I just need to switch it.
Okay, that's the game. It's going to be controls. E map keys. Roll needs to be X. Yes. Use is B. Okay, there. Because I just keep. I can't stop it. Literally, I cannot stop using that button. Mine is just set on using that button as as a use button instead of roll. But my attacks, I keep using the same buttons for attacks as I would use. It's like for a Dark Souls game. So the shoulder buttons. to increase the heal rate. Alright, jump in there. Jump in here. Okay, take that thing out in a few hits. Same thing. Slowly fall down. Slowly fall down here and poof, upside down. He's dead. Got that. And that removed everything up there. And I can go back down and grab you. Light a torch. Alright, that was a lot quicker than I thought it was going to be. Grab you a soldier's palm. Make my way across. Got that, got that. Get away from you because apparently you're glitched. I'm not going to mess with that. I know the boss up here does have a fire base weapon. And my fire defense is not the best defense there is. So reducing that... ...and going physical. I thought I had the key. I guess I have to go up here to grab it then. So you have to pretty much fill this whole map out. Before. This stuff here is immune to fire damage, or takes less damage from fire. Man, those guys, I just hate them, dude. That massive AOE, the amount of damage that they do. Take one out at a time. Should make everything easier. There, there. I got the charred dolls. And fight you. Yep. Okay, one skeleton gone. Up. Another 
skeleton gone. You. Okay, I got the, the Palantine set. I mean about how annoying these things are. They will not let you hit them half the time. And even after they strike you, it's like, dude, really? And there's no way it can take damage while it's in the, in any of those animations. <laughs> has a horrifying looking spiders. I know those things are highly weakened to fire. Okay, cellar key, that's what I needed. spider pit to get that. Well, the good thing about these guys, they are easily taken out with fire. And you should have the fire charm now if you've been roughly following what I've been doing. I'm not going to worry about that dude just because I don't have to. I got that bottom gate open. I have the boss area cleared out for me to make it there. No enemies, I just have to run. <clears throat> I got seven rolls of bread left. That is more than enough bread to do what I need to do. And open you cellar door key. Okay. I think it does around the same damage. 
Time to fight the boss. Disemboweled husk. then I'm going to end this episode and try to fight the boss again next episode just because this may take a while but alrighty then guys thanks for watching like subscribe share this video help this channel grow and with all that said remember most importantly always love the kill take care